The Pope is dead. The throne is vacant. The conclave begins now. We're about to choose the most famous man in the world. And one and a quarter billion souls watching. I'd say this is a pretty fair vision of hell. Well, don't be blasphemous, Ray. Hell arrives tomorrow when we bring in the Cardinals. No sane man would want the papacy. Some of our colleagues seem to want it. Another Cardinal has just turned up. He was never on our list. He has to be an imposter. You look anxious. Everything under control. Where did you get this? The Holy Father was spying on all of us. You should be careful, Thomas. Although we sisters are supposed to be invisible, God has nevertheless given us eyes and ears. What did you discuss with the Holy Father in that final meeting? Arrangements were made in Paris. I should pretend this conversation never took place. But it has taken place. This is a conclave. It's not a war. It is a war. And you have to commit to a side. Why did the Holy Father, in his last official act as Pope, choose me to run this conclave? The reasons would become clear soon enough. <laughs>